All right, I am going to show you how to take the wings off of a queen ant. And normally you wouldn't need to do this, but um, if they happen to be getting wet wings and getting stuck to the tube, um, they can get stuck and it's bad. So um, this is a, I believe a tetra queen. I never actually bothered to ID them, but um, I'm pretty sure it's a tetra queen. She's way smaller than the queen that they're going to have to de-wing, so it's actually it's going to be harder than uh, for them. So what I do, and the reason they're on carpet, is I actually, if you have carpet or something squishy, it actually works in your favor, because it can help you pin the queen down without hurting them. So what you can do is pin them into the carpet, and they might struggle a little bit. And if you have, you're going to need tweezers for this. So what you can do is you can kind of pin them in the carpet and grab preferably a wing but that might be trickier than uh yeah you'd think so okay and uh honestly having a second pair of tweezers would make this infinitely easier as well but um the ones i the ones I have are too heavy for the size queen, so it, I'm just going to assume you only have one pair of tweezers and roll with that. Um, okay, actually, better yet, grab the uh, wings with your fingers, and uh, here we go. So, either way, something needs to grab the wings, and something needs to push against the queen, but don't squeeze, just slightly push. And with a little work, usually the wings will pop off on their own. Um, these ones are still stuck on pretty good, though. Oh, there we go. Ba -bum! I got all four of them at once. Um, so yeah, just be very gentle and just kind of work, work uh, the queen's wings and just very gently pull them out. And you should be able to de-wing your queen without her hurting her. So uh, I'm going to put her back in her test tube now.